So if you guys are looking for any cheap and reliable foot 21 coins, make sure to head over to u7buy.com and use the discount code u7tube for a 5% discount. Yes guys, and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are doing a squad builder around the brand new player moments Tonali, who looks absolutely sick. He's the brand new objective uh, from today's content and honestly his card is Hullet Gang stats. Every stat is above 80. Um, so I thought I'd build a team around him to help you guys um, just use it as a concept you don't have to build this exact team just use it as, as a concept there's some nice links in here boys actually it's a three league hybrid some different players as well there's a few players that a lot of people will use but i've tried to make it quite original as well boys so just before we do begin if you guys could drop a like we'll aim for 20 likes and uh, drop a comment of any other squad builders you guys would like so let's jump into the goalkeeper we have first of all got mr testegan one of the best goalkeepers in, in the game we did need a german goalkeeper um, you could go with Neuer as well, so if you've got Neuer, happy days to Stegen uh, or any other German goalkeepers, maybe even Leno. Uh, but personally, I like to Stegen, so we're going with to Stegen in goal. Um, into the right back spot, we have got Rule Breakers Dumfries, who is actually very good this FIFA. Um, very good on the ball because he had that boost with his Rule Breaker card. Uh, defensively, physically, very, very good. I would definitely put a shadow or an anchor on this card and uh, make him a little bit quicker. Uh, but overall, a very nice card. Does have long throwing tray as well, which is uh, not a bad little uh, boost. Um, next up, we have got a Baumgartel. So this guy's actually a milestone, so you'll need to go and un unlock him. Um, but we did need a German centre-back, I believe it was. Um, so Mr. Baumgartel fits in very well because he's actually a very good card in game. Um, if you put a shadow on him especially, very good card. I know I don't have him on this account, but this is my second account. So on my main account, I've got him. And he's very good. Six foot three, just a beast. He's actually very, very good. Plays better than his stats, in my opinion. Uh, but he does need a shadow on him. Get a shadow on him, on him and uh, boost up his pace. Next centre back. This guy's unbelievable. Uh, we've got Mr. Gossens, very quick. Um, I did actually pack him when foot freezes out, so I used him around that time. Uh, and what a card. I mean, good, good defending stats. Again, I'd put a shadow on him. Fully the boot, boost the pace and defending. Uh, but overall, what a card. Decent on the ball as well. Got good passing for a centre back. Uh, for a centre back, this guy's absolutely sick. Rapid, just very meta. You don't see him in many teams because he's hard to link, but because we've managed to link him on full chem, get him in. Left back, we have got Team of the Week, Hernandez. You could use any version of Hernandez here, really. Uh, this is his second in form, I believe. Uh, but this again, he's, this card's absolutely sick. Little bit dodgy on the ball because of the 67 balance, but other than that, even physically, like pros have been using this card, uh, the 87 especially. Um, he's that good, genuinely. If, if pros are using him, you know he's great. So that's the back four, boys. That is the back four. Let's jump into the midfield. So first midfielder, we have got Mr. Frankie De Jong. You could go with his inform if you've got a, a few extra coins, um, which should be nice, a nice little option. I'm going to quickly turn down the music a little bit. Uh, but De Jong should be a very nice option because he's decent on the ball. i definitely put a shadow on him just to boost up the defending stats. Uh, but yeah, De Jong's one of my favourite cards this year. A very, very good player. Used him a lot as well. Into the next CDM, we've got the beast himself, Mr. Tonali. Get him unlocked. If you have unlocked him, boys, by the way, do let me know how good he is. I'm going to unlock him tonight, probably. Um, and yeah, his card, actually, on paper, looks very nice. Four star weak foot, medium high. Um, again, I'd, I've mentioned it a lot with these defensive players, but I'd definitely put a shadow on him as well. Get the pace up, get the defending stats up. And you've got a great, great card there, so... That is the next CDM. So let's move into the next position. We have got the brand new Team of the Year Honourable mentions Nabil Fakir. This guy's 83 card at the start of the game was absolutely one of my favourite cards on the game. The fact that this guy's got an 88 card now, this guy's going to be so good. 4 star, 4 star, 5 for 8. So he's got that low centre of gravity. Along with the dribbling stats, bro, this card is going to be insane. Finishing stats look great as well. Decent pace. Um, in terms of chem style, I'd probably go with an engine, get the dribbling up, get the pace up a little bit and get the passing up fully. Um, I mean, that's an unbelievable card. Have fun with that card, boys. So um, that's a very nice option. Into the front three, we've got Lionel Messi, who you'd think is expensive. He's at 200k. 200,000 coins for Messi. Uh, this guy's finishing inside the box. He's just, he barely misses. Um, near post, finesse shots. I think he's got finesse shot trait as well. He does finesse shot trait, uh, which is huge for him, really. Um, absolutely unbelievable, well, not unbelievable card, he's not as good as previous years, I don't want to overrate him too much. Unbelievable finishing, that's one thing I'll say. Um, and yeah, he's decent, he's not quite Neymar level or Mbappe level, uh, but he's still one of the best cards in the game. 
four star, four star as well. Um, just a great card, really. Only downside is is his stamina, really. He's, he, no, towards the end of the game, he's going to struggle a little bit. So keep that in mind. Maybe get a super sub ready. Next up, we have got the striker position. This is where you could have several different players. You could have Griezmann. You could also go Usman Dembele. I've personally gone with Benzema. We've gone with Benzema's like fourth, maybe even fifth in form. Um, a good target man. So if you like target men kind of strikers, uh, I personally don't. But um, if you guys do, because I know a lot of people like them, uh, Benzema's going to be very good because he's got four star, four star. Decent dribbling stats for a target man, like a, a, a big guy. Finishing stats though, inside the box, again, he's going to be absolutely incredible. Um, and he does have that outside foot shot trait as well, which is huge. Obviously, finesse shot trait's a lot better this year as well. Uh, so you've got a nice option there. I'll give you a few other options in a second. And then on the left wing spot, to fully link uh, to Nali, I'll, I'll show you the full team now. Uh, we have got Insignia. So that is how the team starts. Let me quickly get rid of my webcam. That's how the team starts in game. Obviously, you can change to several. You could change to 3 5 2. You've got some quick centre backs there, so you could easily play like Dumfries at centre back, stuff like that. Could play 4 4 2 as well. 4 2 3 1. You've got a lot of different options to change into. Um, strike position, like I was saying, you could go Griezmann. There's not a huge difference between Griezmann and a Benzema, really, so you've got a nice option there. If you have a lot of coins, this Kai. I mean, you'll need a lot of coins, but that would be the perfect option, really. Um, but I believe he's quite expensive. I believe he's like a million coins or something like that. Let's have a look. Um, if we go special. Uh, but yeah, if, if you do decide to build a team, let me know how it works. Yeah, he's like a couple mil. That's why I didn't put him in, because it's just ridiculous. Um, but I thought I'd give you a few other options. Um, if you want to upgrade the team, boys, there's a lot of different special cards you can go. You can upgrade to De Jong's special card. I believe Messi's got an inform as well, so you could upgrade to Messi's inform. Um, Teo Hernandez has got a high rated left back so the good thing with this team is it's, it's upgradable as well which is absolutely sick to see so uh, anyway boys I'll quickly show you the team over on my left let me get it on to my left um, I'll quickly show you the team if we go to monitor All right so this is the team um, and yeah it's coming in at around 1.3 on Xbox 1.5 on PS um, and yeah it's very very nice very very nice so um, yeah, anyway, if you do decide to use the team, do let me know how it works. If you guys could drop a like, that would be much appreciated. We'll aim for 20 likes. Jobs will be for you, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.